Hey guys, so I know earlier we made a video about Crybaby and how she's just looking really big and I mean, I was thinking it was going to be Red Bear, but Brandon came and got me and was hollering through the trailer. It's about 12 o'clock at night and he said, Crybaby's had a baby. She's had a baby. She's having them right now. So I ran outside and this is what I found. Of course, Brandon's got the camera going also. You can't miss these things. Look at her. Which we don't know if she's a boy or girl, but we're going to just wait until tomorrow. We'll check that. Like I told Steph earlier, we bought these extra uh, lights here a couple weeks ago. And for this reason, waiting for her to give birth. But luckily, it ain't as cold as it was last night. No, it's going to be in the 60s for at least a week or two. You're doing a great job, like that, baby. Good job. Good mama. Just that way, it'll make a little bit more heat. Is that sack all from that one baby, or is that like another baby? It would, it would, if it's another baby, it's one that didn't make it. <laughs> yeah, you hear babies? Are you thinking it's yours? They're not your babies. Crab babies having babies. Yeah, crybaby's having babies. It's okay. You're a good mama to hear that baby cry, though. Yeah. You talking to her or to the baby? I don't know if it's a girl or boy yet. We haven't we haven't got that far into it yet. I guess Red Bear thinks she needs to come over here and check things out. Is everything all right over here, Red Bear? Huh? Hey guys, welcome back to Life on the Eddie Family Farm. I'm Stephanie. This is my gracious helper, Brandon. And we are actually sponsoring Jason which is an electric bike and it's going to be really cool to open it and show y'all guys how to assemble what we got. Yeah so they reached out to Stephanie and um, they agreed to send us two bikes so we could actually ride together uh, being out here in the country and stuff so um, we're going to go ahead and record setting one of them up and hopefully um, y'all like what you see like I said 
I've never opened one of these up, so I don't know what it's going to take. So we're going to bring y'all along with us. So hope you enjoy. So you got the handy dandy knife? Yep, yeah, got the knife. We're going to go ahead and open it up. Should we go ahead and lay it to the side? Yeah, let me get these open first. Maybe not. Yeah, in a unfold. Like that. Easy as pie. Wow. Oh, so pretty. Oh, People are trash pile back that way. Stand this dude up here. I think it's upside down. Which I think we have to probably have it upside down. Who knows? Pretty exciting. This is my first sponsored video. And that's that's that's, that's pretty exciting. This is a charger. Okay. There's the pedals, which we will let's go ahead and put the pedals on. Okay. And started in here all right now I'm just seeing a bunch of tools in here so we'll get this opened up and get our tools boy how there's a bunch of them find the right ones yeah Got that on this back part. You know this Brandon does not need instructions. No, instructions just get you lost. No, I, I sometimes I do, but sometimes some of this stuff is a self-explanatory. Here, let me do one of them started. It's not. Let me see that. You gotta hand me that so I can open this up over here. Just like you did.
Meet ya. Now you need this, maybe? Hey, there's that part. Put your knife. Right here. Moving on up to the seat, I guess, I'm assuming. Oh well, you can adjust it however tight, uh, and it's got actual measurements back here. You can adjust it however tight you want it, or however tall you want it. All right, let's move up here to the front to the tire. Now we're going to go ahead and flip this dude over. Oh, and we apologize about the wind in advance. Um, I guess we should have put the tire on first. Put the tire on first, but um, let me see. Maybe this here will work. Does this go? I believe it. That's oh no, side. it goes this side. Yeah, this is on this side. It has, oh, it's got little brakes. You might have to back that screw off a little bit. You got your tight? Yeah, mine just needs tightened with the wrench. Well, oh, you must be special. You got, you got electric bike sent to you. And flip it over this way. Pretty heavy, huh? Yeah. And now we will. Set it up like that. And then we can we can lower it as after we get everything set up. Um, I'll probably have to go through. Oh no, you won't be able to do that. Slide it to right there. Would it be on that back side? Yeah. So there she is. All right, guys, it is complete. Um, I did notice right in here is where the actual battery is kept. So if you, you know, for some reason have to take it apart to get the battery out or whatever, uh, the battery is kept right here. Um, you do have a quick connect to actually charge it here on the side, and I'll show you that in just a second, which will make that a lot easier than having to take the battery out every time. Um, the keys, um, we did a lot of research on this before we started, and believe it or not, the keys are actually, goes underneath here, and the keys are to actually release the bike, the battery. There's the light. We got a horn. Got a horn. So, um, now we are going to try to figure out how this little thing goes. So we're going to stroll it out here. But first, before we do that, we're going to go ahead and pause and we will put the second bike together. That way we can ride them together. So we're not going to make you watch the whole process of us putting the second one together. So we're going to pause it here and we'll be right back with another bike. All right, guys. So we just finished putting them both together and they're pretty awesome looking and we did get a white one and a black one. I didn't realize we was getting two different colors. I thought maybe we'll just get two black ones, but so I'm kind of excited about that. I get a little bit excited about little things, you know, but we're going to take them for a ride and go see what they are capable of.
All right, so if you look here on the handlebars, <laughs> you'll see you have your lights. So you have lights if you want to ride in the dark. You got your horn. And then this actually goes to your bright lights. And then you have your power up and power down. To start it, here, I'll turn it off. And you'll see on this screen, I will hold down the power button and it will start up and it will show you your actual speed when you're driving. I don't know how fast these can go and I may not be brave enough to actually go as fast as they will go, but we're gonna try. And also you can power up on this. It's just like a motorcycle. You twist it and it goes. But now we are gonna go try them. We will leave a link in the description box so that you can click on it and see if you might wanna ride one. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Holy cow, it's got, it's got a lot more power than what I thought, especially on these rocks. I know, I'm only going like three miles, or I'm only a set on three. It actually shows that it's going, here in a minute, I'll show you all the actual speed. It's saying we're going 6.8 miles an hour. I didn't really think it would do very good on the rocks, but it's got big wheels. It's doing a lot better than what I thought. And I also like that you can pedal and it it will go the speed with your pedaling. And then you let off the pedals, you stop pedaling, and it automatically stops and slows it down. Hey, these things are not bad. I know. This is a nice little toy for us adults. <laughs> All right, guys, here we go. I think you got it down now. We're getting a little bit braver. Pretty smooth, especially on the pavement. I'm up to 14, 15. Up to 17 miles an hour. How fast are you? Here she comes. 18 miles an hour. 18, I was at 17. 18.7. Stay on your side, sir. Oh, I'm going 20 now. <laughs> I have to slow down behind you. You have it on five? Yeah. We're on the road now. There's one truck. I gotta keep Brandon safe. Where you at? I'm coming. I used to be a bike rider. All right, there's a truck. Over. I'm over. <laughs> it's a lot of fun, guys. A lot Linger. of fun. 